Elon Musk's Twitter has become a safe haven for hate, and Australia's had enough. An Australian cyber regulator is demanding answers now that Twitter has become the country's most complained about platform, even though it has far fewer users than Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. The eSafety Commissioner also noted that Twitter apparently reinstated over 60,000 banned accounts following Musk's takeover. The company has been given 28 days to reply to a legal complaint or start facing fines of nearly half a million dollars a day. A tourist to Rome could be facing serious consequences after defacing the Colosseum. Italy's culture minister tweeted out a video of the man using his keys to carve Ivan plus Haley 23 into a nearly 2,000-year-old wall. That same tweet called for the man to be identified and sanctioned, and in this case, that could mean a fine of roughly 16 grand or up to five years in prison. Although, given the nature of the crime, it might be appropriate to feed him to a lion. And an update to the UK's online safety bill will make it easier to prosecute those who share revenge porn. Specifically, prosecutors will no longer have to prove that the perpetrators intended to cause distress in their victims, though that will affect how much jail time the convicted are looking at. Deepfake porn has also now been criminalized, with those who share it facing up to six months in prison. Of course, they too should be fed to the lions, but this is a decent start. That's your first look at the news, and me, don't go away.